What's up guys and welcome back to an extra episode uh, today of uh, No Group Racing. Uh, today uh, we're going to choose a slightly different car to the beast that we chose in the previous episode. Uh, and today we're going to go with the Ford RS1800. It's one of the uh, DLC cars uh, from the last track pack, track pack, car pack. Uh, and as you can see we're in a lobby full of the dreaded driver cars. Um, I don't recognise any of these names. Um, but if it's any of my subs, uh, leave me a comment and let me know which one it is. Um, so yeah, what we're going to do is the Bernese Alps uh, Club Reverse, I think. Um, we'll just start it underway. Uh, and again, I've uh, reduced the grip for this car down to around uh, 25%. Um, so this is going to be really, really interesting. Um, I'm going to guess there's going to be a lot of crashes again. Um, I'm not, I haven't driven this car yet on the multiplayer or single player. Um, so I don't even know what to expect from it, but I'm going to guess it's going to be yeah, slightly tail happy, even more so with reduced grip. Um, but hopefully it's going to be a lot of fun. Hopefully we can avoid a lot of the crashes and maybe sneak a few places. And uh, maybe even get ourselves a win, which uh, would be very nice. Um, but <laughs> I have no idea what's going to happen. Uh, anything is possible in no grip racing. Um, so yeah, hopefully this isn't going to take too long. <laughs> I've tried to pick the uh, small tracks and the tracks there we can't go off and get stuck in the sand anywhere. Okay, so here we are on the grid and we're not quite last. Um, so hopefully we can uh, boost up a few places. And we're off with lots of wheel spin. Let's race through the gears a little bit, see if we can try and get some traction in force. Uh, let's go down a gear. Oh, we're uh, spinning the tyres up, let's not give it full gas. We're getting overtook and the back end wants to go already and we're on the straight, that's not a good sign. But overtaken by Louise 8. Oh, sliding. Oh, the car's taking a high line through here. This is only a lightweight car, so we may have a bit of a bit of a handling. Although it does understeer like a pig, uh, we've managed to stay off the majority of the wall so far. Hopefully, we can try and catch up through this section with a tank slapper on into the wall. Can we sneak up the inside while they're all bashing each other? We can. There's a couple of spaces there. A little nudge. Get rid of the wing mirror. We don't need that. Uh, we're up into ninth. Always oh, seems to be the answer is keep it in a high gear and we can have uh, some at least some traction. Whoa, that was vicious. That snapped and we're going into the wall. So now it's the snail turning around the corner. Can we keep it off the wall and get some traction? It's technically not on the track still, but over the rumble strip. Can we turn? No, we can't. This is going to be into the wall. We're up in 6 6. I think we can get 50 out on this corner. We'll break a little bit. Not that it makes a great deal of difference. It's like the world's slowest drift around the corner. And I've just remembered what corner's next. Uh, there's a slight uphill uh, gradient. Whoa, that's gone. Yeah, there's a slight uphill gradient on the next corner. So we might have a bit of an issue actually getting up the hill. And going into the corner backwards isn't going to help us whatsoever. So can we carry any speed up this hill and get to the top? This may be interesting. This perhaps wasn't the best track to choose. Can we go? Can we go? Can we go? Can we go? Come on. Can oh, no. No. Didn't want to do that. Now we are going to struggle. I think the one in front of me stopped. He is totally struggling. Lots and lots of tyre smoke. Oh, we're falling back, we're losing places. <laughs> There's some cars that technically aren't going to make it and they're going back down for another attempt. Oh, then risk changing into another gear. Should we risk it? I mean, is it going to make any difference whatsoever? I don't know, I can't tell. We're doing two miles an hour. Leaving a nice trail of uh, black lines behind us. Look like those uh, four cars down there have just given up. Um, uh, yeah, this this part is probably isn't the most exciting race in the world. <laughs> so far, it's been three minutes and ten seconds, and we got a car on the left that's uh, given up as well. He decided to reverse back down the hill. That's going to cause them two issues. Oh, so that's another three cars that are going to be wiped out as long as he doesn't swerve across into me. No, 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 get away. Let's 
it. You fuck off down the hill. Oh, we've got another one filing. He's down. We are creeping up. <laughs> oh, and there's a, there's a bit of a blockage at the top as well. Oh, I think we might actually... Is there any cars? Oh, one car's actually... Or a couple of cars by the looks of the map is actually finished. So you've got 1 minute 30 to get all the way around. 1 minute 30, we could get third place here. Come on, Escort. Come on, little Escort. You can do it. Yeah, those cars at the bottom, they're definitely not going to make it. Come on, we've got 1 minute 12 to get past these three. We've got those three of, uh, doing a bit of solid scene as well. And the cars are rocking. Maybe we shouldn't go knocking. Uh, yeah, we'll... Uh, don't know what's going on over there. Like the drivers might be getting a little bit friendly with each other. Oh, we're up into seventh. Up into sixth. And we're up into fifth. Now, the next challenge is, can we actually finish in 46 seconds? Um, I'm going to take a shot in the dark and say possibly no. Uh, we don't stand the cat in hell, Shons. Uh, but we're going to give it our best shot. Come on, we can go now. Up to four miles now, five, we're picking up a bit of speed. Come on, come on, let's go. Fair to say the right hand rear tyre is um, a little bit overheated. No, we've got no control. Come on, right then. 20 seconds, we're, we're looking if we're even going to get around this corner in 20 seconds. No, we've spun. But we did make it to the top of the hill, so in my books, that's a fucking win. Uh, I'm going to take that one. And we haven't sustained that much damage either. Paintwork's a little bit chipped, a little bit scratched. Um, but at least we're not stuck in a big heap like the rest of the cars are down the bottom. Um, so, yeah. So, uh, apart from the uh, bit of uh, crappy track selection on my behalf, uh, that didn't turn out too bad. Fifth position. Uh, it's better than the uh, Ford Raptor that we did last time. Um, yeah. So, um, let me know what you think of that, guys. Wasn't exactly the uh, smartest, but what I'm going to do is... Oh, I can't even show you the replay because of the crappy multiplayer function on Forza 5. Um, but yeah, that would have been quite entertaining to watch the multiplayer. Um, but there you go, guys. There's the episode 2 of uh, No Grip Racing in the Ford Escort RS 1800. As always, if you enjoyed it, uh, feel free to uh, leave me a like or all the other stuff that you do. Um, and uh, until next time, I shall see you all soon.